if your business uses Facebook, you should be using Facebook Business Manager. It's an important tool that helps keep your uh, business assets centralized, safe, and organized. So if you've been putting off setting up your business manager, you're in luck because today I'm gonna show you exactly how it works and how to set it up in this video. Before we dive in, be sure to subscribe to the channel and click that notification bell to be alerted when my next video goes live. So what is Facebook Business Manager? As Facebook explains it, Business Manager serves as a one-stop shop to manage business tools, business assets, and employee access to these assets. Basically, it's a, a, a place to manage all of your Facebook marketing and advertising activities. It's also where you control you can control um, multiple users' access to additional resources like your Instagram account, and product catalogs. Here are some of its key functions, right? It, it keeps your business activities separate from your personal profile, so you don't have to worry about posting in the wrong place or get distracted. Um, it's a central place for you to track Facebook ads with detailed reports that show you how your ads are performing. Um, it also allows you to give vendors, partners, and agencies access to your pages and ads without handing over ownership of those assets. And also, as coworkers don't see your personal Facebook information, just your name, work email, page, and ad accounts. So how do you set this up? Let's dive right in. The first step of setting up your um, business manager is to create an account. Uh, you'll need a personal uh, Facebook profile to confirm your identity, but as mentioned before, your coworkers and partners won't have access to your personal information. So the first thing you're gonna do is go to business.facebook.com and you're gonna click on the, the, big, ble the big blue green uh, create account button on the right. And you're gonna have to log into your uh, Facebook profile. Let me log in here. So we're gonna enter our uh, business name here and I'll just call this BK Steppers for now. I'll, my name is there. Um, business email, we'll keep it the same. And then we'll hit next. It's gonna ask you for uh, business details, country, street address, et cetera. So we'll just type that in here. We'll just use a PO box that I have. Phone number and website. And we hit submit. And so BK Steppers was created and an email was sent to my email address to confirm. All right, so here we are inside the uh, business manager and you can see uh, the ad account performance, uh, pages attached, which are none. And so what you wanna go ahead and do is go to business settings and add ad accounts and pages. If I go to business settings here by clicking on this button here, and we are now in uh, the business settings. What we can do here is under users, we can add people to the account. Um, so right now it's just me on the account here. If I click on the add button here, the blue button here, I can go ahead and invite people to join the business manager. All I have to do is enter their email address and then decide you know, what business role I want them to have. Will they be an employee or will they have full admin access or Will they be a finance analyst or a finance editor, right? So you can invite people to join your business manager at any one of these roles here. Uh, we're gonna go down to pages. And if I go to pages here, you can uh, add new pages to, uh, add pages to the account, meaning if a page was already created and this business owns a page, I can bring that page over here. Uh, I can request access to a page or I can create a new page. So to add a page, just go click on add a page. You would type in the page name or URL and then click add page. Uh, if you wanted to request access to a page, meaning you're gonna be managing uh, someone's page, um, basically you would do is add a page. Again, put the URL in there and then click add page. And then the last option is to create a page. 
if I don't already have a page, I can create a page for my business. So I go through categories here and choose the you know appropriate one, give the page a name, a category, etc. Um, for ad accounts, uh, you can add an ad account, meaning if you have a personal ad account that you want to move over to your business manager, you can do that. Uh, if you're going to be managing um, other people's ad accounts, you can request access to an ad account or you can create a new ad account for your business. OK, and that's pretty much it. So that's how you uh, set up a business manager account. If you have questions, definitely put them in the comments below and be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell to be notified of my next video. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.